Dobrý den. Today I would like to talk about Wallace words or sentences in Czech, le virlong or tongue twisters. Part one. Do not be impressed in front of Wallace sentences and why I declare them nonsensical. And part two. How to ease the pronunciation of Wallace words in Czech? Because Wallace sentences is just for the show. Wallace words, you will need them. Oh, you, the new Czech student. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Trch prst skrz krk. Strč prst skrz krk. No. Or perhaps. Listen, girl, and repeat. Škrt plh zmrh brt, pln skvrn zmrv. Prv hrd stvrkl z brst skrz trs hrb, v krs vrb, ml smrh srn, čtvrt hrst zrn. This, dear students, would be the longest Czech phrase, composed entirely of consonants. Your homework. For tomorrow. When I think of what precedes, where is the point of uttering these sentences in front of a beginner? So why people exhibit in front of you, my dear student, these semantically, syntactically valid clauses without a single wall? Do not be impressed, please. Do not let yourself fall into despair, if they do. Czech uses two liquid consonants and its grammar allows the creation of numerous long, sound wallless sentences with liquid consonants underlying every syllable. Strč prskrskrk is a classic example. In phonetics, liquids or liquid consonants are a class of consonants consisting of lateral approximants like L or rotics like R. What Wikipedia says about the tongue twister stretch prst skrz krk? The sentence is well known for being a semantically and syntactically valid clause without a single wall. The nucleus of each syllable being a syllabic R. Strč, prst, skrz, krk. What is syllabic consonant? A syllabic consonant is a consonant that forms a syllable on its own, like the M, N, L, in the English words rhythm, button and bottle. So English too has two liquid consonants L, R. Résumé. In Czech we can find two liquid consonants, the syllabic L and the rhotic R. As a result there are plenty of words without walls. For example, stvrnkls, čtvrthrst and čtvrtsmršť. The letter two being artificial occasionalisms. Please remember these two words. Artificial occasionalisms. So if someone starts in front of you again with strčprst, you know 
how to react. Barbara with your artificial occasionalisms. What on the other hand is worth of your attention and interest and learning and energy and effort are simple walls, words, ling. The dictionary basically gives you 58 examples of walls words in Czech. It's not an exhaustive list, but it's a start. We have 13 occurrences, starting with a S. S, preposition. Stvrnkl, stvrkl, schrň, skrz, smrk. Smrt, srp, srp. Srst, strhl. Strč, strš. And now, the most important part, how to ease the pronunciation of such words. Simply by inserting a schwa sound, a, uh, in between each pair of consonants. So the famous strč prst skrz krk will become, for your beginnings in Czech, Sterech, perest, skeres, kerek. And it becomes immediately, I hope, more abordable. Of course, stretch, prst, skrs, krk is very difficult. Very difficult. Conclusion. Invent or search for a phrase in your own language known as a difficult virlong or tongue twister and use it as a va retro tool against a fool who knows you with a roller through. He must be a fool. Yes. Wool. Oh yes. This would be another good subject. For the next video perhaps. Thank you for your comments. Thank you for the inspiration for this video. And keep them coming. Uh, if you have any difficulties, I would like to read about them in the comments. So stretch prst skrz krk and brzy naschledanou. Vůl!